20 Minecraft build ideas for when you're bored. Number one, these are not in any particular order by the way. If you have any walls around your house that are just looking empty, add some shelves or just some depth to your wall like this. Instead of putting torches or paintings on your walls, this will give it a much better look. This design you're looking at right now is actually inspired by the mythical sausage. He likes using this stripped spruce log look. Number two, rainbow sheep farm. These things look very cool. They can give you practically unlimited wool of every type. So why wouldn't you want to make this? If you're a pixel art kind of guy, this will be perfect. As you can see, I've got stacks upon stacks of all these different colors here. Also, it will be helpful to keep a chest of shears nearby in case you need to refill these farms. I especially like this because the farms are so compact and easy to make. Number three, realistic stove. If you have a marble themed kitchen or a realistic kitchen, this is a cool thing you can add. Now you will notice that I've been jumping from world to world here. Some of these ideas are just general build ideas from my own survival worlds and some will be small ideas or decorations that you can incorporate inside of your own builds, which I will show you how to make. You can also switch out the sides here for whatever suits your kitchen, for example I can change these to just plain iron blocks if I want. Number 4, Map Wall. If you have a big survival world that you've made a lot of progress in, for example this world right here, I used to play a lot back in 2020, you'll see that I have a lot of buildings in this area. Place a map wall kind of off in the center of all your builds, an ideal location would be something like a town square. It's just kind of cool to see all your builds start to progress in a top down view. Number 5, Place Down Objects. This simple little build hack can add lots of detail to your builds. Use an item frame placed on the top face of a block and put an item inside of it. It will look like the object is just laying on the surface. Now I'm not sure about this, but I think there might be a texture pack out there that can change the item frames and make them invisible, adding even more realism to this. Number 6, Street Lamp. This street lamp is one of my favorites, you can incorporate it in basically any type of road. I'm going to build this during the night to hopefully show off its glow better. Number 7, Hanging Plants. Now there's many different designs for hanging plants, but this one is just a simple, non-complex build that takes minimal resources and time. So the farthest left chain goes down 3, then the next one goes down 1, then 2, then 3 again, then 1, and finally 2. Now let's add some lanterns and leaves of your choice, just like this. I think this would look nice on the side of a building or in an underpass. Number 8, Cracks in a Road. Come on guys, basic flat roads like this are getting really boring really fast. Use some stair blocks like this to create cracks inside of your road. You can twist and turn them around to make them look more like cracks. You can even add a stream of water going through it like this. This is a really sad looking river but you get the idea. Number 9, Basic Cart. This cool looking cart can be added in any sort of medieval town or village. Since it is only 1x4 blocks in size, it will be very easy to find a place for this. Number 10, Hatched Egg. I suggest adding this small design into a chicken farm or a coop, it doesn't have to be functional. Make sure you add the water bucket hidden within the trapdoors or else the coral will end up dying. I'm going to be using a turtle egg but a normal egg will work as well. In my opinion I just think the turtle eggs look a bit cooler. Number 11, Odd Chair. This one's kinda just for fun, build one inside your house for a comfortable and relaxing experience. Number 12, Hidden Base. We are back in a survival world for this one. If you haven't already, definitely go and try to build a hidden base or room. For example, this one you gotta throw an item at a certain block and it will open up a hidden trap door. These can be small and simple like this one, or it can be a huge staircase that opens up out of the floor. Number 13, Real Mining Hole. 
If you need a lot of stone for a build, try making a large hole in the ground and adding wooden bridges just spiraling around to add realism. Also make an area at the top for you to store all of your stone. As you can see, I never finished and polished this up, that's why I have a beacon down there, but you just need to add pathways going down and maybe some support beams thrown in there too. Hopefully you can get a basic idea from this and I think it would look cool to have one of these inside of your world. Number 14. Functional Meat Closet Building off of the realistic stove mentioned back on number 3, here is another nice addition to your kitchen. You can keep your meats in these barrels back here so this build is actually functional. Number 15. Fancy Campfire Here's a cool looking campfire to add in a campsite along with maybe a trailer and some logs on the side to act as seats. Number 16, Pool. In my backyard here, I've got a very simple pool design. If you have access to the prismarine block types, I highly recommend you try a pool like this. Add some seal entrance at the bottom to create some light emitting from the pool. I think prismarine blocks just go well with any sort of water build. Number 17, Decorated Villager Halls. Don't be that boring guy with a bunch of villagers in a jail-like hall. Do something like this that gives it a more cozier and homey look. Add stripped logs, stairs, trap doors, lanterns, and even some greenery like leaves. The villagers are going to thank you. Number 18, Greenhouse. Sometimes you should build a place that you can just relax in and take in Minecraft's beauty. Make sure you have a large variety of different flowers and plants. I even have a whole cactus in here. Also a good tip is to use spruce trap doors as shelves so you can display your plants up higher. You can place basically anything on them including flower pots and lanterns. Number 19, Hanging Towels. These are so simple to make and add in any bathroom wall, they look super nice and stylish too. And just like that, it is done, you just need 3 blocks for this build. Number 20, Disc Shelf. Got a bland wall? Here's a cool way to spice it off and show off all your cool discs as well. Thank you guys for watching it all the way to the end. I know this is not a video I usually would do, but I hope you don't mind me making some different style videos just to expand my creativity a bit. I wanted to show you guys some build ideas I've had in my mind for a while now, and a lot of you have commented about how you guys like my building style. Also, it's getting harder for me to upload with the same schedule I had during the summer, so it'd be awesome if you guys could be a little patient with me. There isn't going to be a common shout out for this video, I'll reserve that for the next 100 days episode that I release. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you guys next time.